aviators are on the road this week. They're at Sacramento. And they return one week from tonight, which will be Wag Your Tail Wednesday. Ron Futrell is here to explain in tonight's Flying High. I like that graphic, Ron. How about that? That looks pretty good. Okay. Yes, on Wednesday nights, the dogs are welcome at Las Vegas Ballpark. They call it Wag Your Tail Wednesdays or Bark on the Berm. Uh, leading the way out of the ballpark will be the aviator's very own Finn the Bat Dog. The new ballpark is getting its share of attention, but Finn the Bat Dog is the showstopper out there. He's a six-year-old black lab who retrieves bats and has a few other responsibilities. I entertain the crowd. Go out there, he does all kinds of stuff. He brings the umpires water. He uh, plays frisbee during the during the pitching changes. So um, and just generally, you know, causes a little bit of trouble. Then there was this. Just last week, an umpire did his job by moving the bat right before Finn got there. And, well, you hear the response from the fans. I motioned for him to go over and pick up the bat, and as he was heading in that direction, uh, the umpire picked up the bat. Uh, in fairness to the umpire, I'm not sure. I think maybe when he saw, you know, maybe he wasn't familiar with Finn before. And when he saw the dog stop, um, maybe he just it was trying to keep the game from being held up or something. I don't know. The umpire was doing his job. Yeah, the umpire was doing his job. And Finn did his job and still went and got the bat. The video has over 4 million views on Twitter. Finn actually started at Cashman Field and has moved to the new ballpark where fans and players love to hang out with him. They just love him, you know, and I, I really notice it when I go outside because when he's walking into the arena, you know, everybody's like, hi, Finn, you know, so it's been great. He loves it here. He loves the people. The players love him, and it's so nice having a team that's winning all the time and just a whole different atmosphere here. Yeah, smile. Very photogenic pup right there, okay? Finn has a Twitter handle, of course. It's at Finn the Bat Dog. He's got almost 18,000 followers right now. Now, I, I mentioned Bark on the Berm every Wednesday. Here's a look at that berm jam-packed with fans. This shot is looking east to the right field corner where there's a nice grass berm out there. And it brought back a lot of memories of Cashman Field. Cashman Field back in the day. When I say back in the day, I'm talking when I first got to town here, 1984-85. They had just one level out there well, of the outfield fence. So they had a berm out there that you can go out there with your family, hang out. I did that often, and, and the kids Aww. were young then and took them out there out of Cashman Field. So it's nice that they could do that again. And on Wednesdays, Perfect. Bring, bring the pups. Good memories. I'd like to point out, too, as you mentioned, Finn the yes. Bat Dog has a Twitter handle. Last tweet. I think my buddy Ron Futrell is talking about me again. <laughs> oh, oh, I love it. I'm going to retweet Finn right now. Okay, Finn. <laughs> Finn has a voice. That was a great story. It's so Thank fun you. to see him in action. You know, he, he's a great dog. And he's out there for about the first three innings of the game because he can't stay the whole so night. Sure. They've got to get some rest, okay? So but the fans love him out there. So we'll uh, do more. We'll do more. We'll follow up on this. We and love we Finn. love you too, Finn. <laughs> Thanks, Ron.